Aaron Goodwin grew up in a small town in western Canada. He always was interested in music, and now his dreams are coming true. He's got some real good stuff happening with his career. It's a pleasure to have him with us here on 207, Aaron Goodwin. go there running from the empty looking for a little light just another face in the crowd of the broken hearted so we dance and we sing and pretend that we're all alright but we're not and we know it but we won't show it well there's one swing wide open no matter who you are it's where Jesus knows to go to find the sinners and the saints it's where you hit your knees say a prayer and take a drink cause we're all hurt and we're all searching in bars and churches Chasing long Drowning out the devil with the devil Trying to drag you down Pouring out your heart to the ear of a perfect stranger Hoping that they'll listen, that they'll care, that they'll give a damn but they just want the same thing too They came here just to lie on 207 on his Bars and Churches tour. Thanks for coming in. Great to have you here. Thank you so much, Ted. As Thank said, you for having me. You grew up in a small town, Spirit sure River, Alberta. Yes. I understand that you sort of had an early break when you won a singing contest at the local mall. Yeah. What be, song did you sing? Be My Baby Tonight, John Michael Montgomery. You know the one, could you, would you, ain't you gonna, if I asked you, would you want it? That's a good one for a young kid. Don't How worry. old were you? Twelve. As I said, things have worked out pretty well for you. Let's just go over some of the stuff that's happening. Uh, number one song in Canada with You Are, uh, award for Songwriter of the Year from the Canadian Country Music Association last year. Yes. Luke Bryan recording your songs, but you're not an overnight success. You've been in Nashville for nine years, so this is the result, I assume, of a lot of hard work. Most people say that Nashville's a 10-year town. I say it's a nine-year town. <laughs> 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 that's about all I got on that it's a you know what this is a you know this is a way of life for me I've, I've loved um, music ever since I was young and I always wanted to as soon as I got on stage for the first time was the like that was the time that I really realized you know like that I just loved being up there and it kind of felt like I was like right at home more so than I am you know sitting here talking to you you know it's just one of those things that I just absolutely love to do and you know, I'm very grateful that I get to do it. So. You've done a lot of writing and you've been successful, and that's a good way to make a living, but is performing what really lights performing up your life? Performing is, is, is why I do everything else, you know. Um, but I always wanted to be, you know, I, I, songwriting was something that I had to learn, you know. 
um, singing was something I had to learn. Like the being on stage part is the part where I just kind of just do what, you know, whatever. Um, it's just kind of that, you know, my calling, so to speak. And the rest I had to like learn how to do. But I had a knack for writing songs, so I figured, well, maybe that's my way in to the business. So I started doing that, and I started writing songs with people that I just really enjoyed spending time with and writing songs with, and it's it's worked out pretty good. So. It's going great. Thanks for coming in. It's good to have you here. We appreciate Thank it. Thank you so if much like for having me. more information on Aaron and what he's up to, check out our website, and we're going to be back right after this.